Child sleepovers are fun for the kids and you can take it to the next level with a dreamy party they will remember and probably never forget. A local business can do it all for you with memorable settings and themes right down to personal touches. Julie McInerney is the owner of Sweet Mitten Dreams. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having us. This is so exciting. So tell us a little bit about what you offer because you saw my reaction when I saw this. I was like, ah, this is amazing. Tell yes. us. So we offer teepee and glamping parties for ages really from three all the way to 16. And we offer our teepee business. Uh, this is really where it started with our selling our teepees, but now we do rentals with our teepees. These are great. So let's start with the basics and then build from there. What should people consider before planning a sleepover? So I think that two things you should consider is the theme. So as you can see, we have two different themes going here. Mm -hmm. And when you have boys versus girls and they have their different interests, a theme is really important. And then also how many guests you want to have at your yes. party. Got to think about that. Yeah. Got to think about that. Yeah. So take me through what we have here. We've got something looking with like army fatigue, looking very campy-ish, and then something that's a little bit more my style. But let's start over there. <laughs> yeah. So all of our themes, we have about 15 themes that okay. our clients can choose from, which is really exciting. But if there's not a theme that we have, we can also customize a theme. We have our pure Michigan camper theme here. So it's for those kids that really want to feel like they're in in that forest mm. and experiencing the camping experience. And then this is our chasing after dreams in the D. So this is our dream catcher theme uh, that we have. It's a little bit more girly and yeah. fun and pastel -y. I love it, I love it. So once the basics are covered, what are some fun ways to add special touches? Yeah, so this is a big uh, piece here, our balloons. Yeah. So this highlights kind of that birthday girl, the birthday boy. This is really popular amongst our, our clients. You can highlight just one single teepee or you can carry them all the way through. Uh, you can add activities to your teepee experience. A lot of our teepee experiences do have activities already included. I love it. Uh, and then some other ways you can personalize are our personalized pillowcases there. Uh, you see the one that says Brady on it. I did, that's and, so cool. Yeah, we can. you can use that as a, as a favor as well. So it's a really nice way and then everyone gets a pillow. So. Uh, that is, so, it's like an all-in-one kind of thing. Come yeah. to the sleepover party, you've yeah. got your, pil your pillow as your party favor, it's yeah. all said and done. Yeah. So you mentioned this just a little bit, but let's talk about the age range again. So yeah. you said from three to? So for these teepees, three to 10 okay. is the best age. And then thank you to our clients that have older siblings. They inspired us to start our outdoor glamping business. And that is really good for like the 10 and up. Yeah. We do graduation parties, we do sweet 16s, the double digits when you turn 10. So thanks to them, we expanded our business to our outdoor experiences. Let me tell you something. Even yes. if you're under 10 and you see your younger sibling have this, it's going to be like, excuse me, exactly. where, when is my party? Exactly. So I get that. So now what about snacks? Because you always want a little something yummy with a, a, a party. Yeah. So we offer a popcorn bar, oh. Sunday bars. And then over here, we have our s'more table. We actually handmade this. My husband, Danny, did that last summer. So it's a safe way to kind of bring the outdoors in. Uh, and that is our s'more table there. And then also I wanted to highlight in these bags, every guest gets a snack favor bag that has Michigan made snacks in them. So we wanna support the mitten, right? Yes. In our name, Sweet Mitten Dreams, we wanna support Michigan made snacks. So those are in there. I love this, I love the whole concept. Yeah. I think some adults might be interested in this as well. Yes. I'll raise my hand. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So how can people learn more about Sweet Mitten Dreams? So we are on all the social media platforms, TikTok, Sweet Mitten, uh, Sweet Mitten Dreams, at Sweet Mitten Dreams for Instagram, Facebook, and then of course our website. And the best way to get in touch with me is email. Julie at SweetMittenDreams.com. Can't mess that one up. Julie, thank you yeah. so much. Thank this you. is awesome. Thank, thank you, you so much for having us.